One of Vault Ireland's key strategic pillars is around supporting the development of a world-class industry. And really in today's business environment, supporting tourism businesses in the context of Brexit is really important. So one of the tools we've put in place is the Brexit Readiness Check, and it can be accessed through the Vault Ireland website. And we've worked with Crow um, to develop this, and really it's designed to give you a reporter immediately that gives you a pretty good snapshot of, of where your business is at. And although the diagnostic was really created in the context of Brexit, uh, if you look at it, it's kind of really a tool that helps you look at the fundamentals of your business, really whether Brexit was happening or not. Now, as I said, you can access it through the Fault Ireland website. So you can see there's a link here on the start here, the orange button on each page. Once you actually, there's a short registration process, and once you log in, you'll see that it focuses on four key sections. So it's around GB and Northern Ireland market retention, market diversification, driving business performance and competitiveness, and then looking at the people capability within your business. Now, filling it out is really straightforward. There's about, there's five questions in each section. Um, it takes less than 10 minutes to complete and you don't need any financial data. And you'll see here, this is an example of some of the questions that are in each section. And they're very straightforward and then you just need to click a yes or no answer, depending on which suitable for your business. So as soon as you've completed the survey, it'll it automatically print you a report. And there's a few different elements to this report. So here, first of all, on the first page is a summary report. And you can see we use kind of like a traffic light system. So the green are areas where you're, you're progressing well, and then the red are really probably the highlight the areas in your business that you should prioritize and address first. Then there's going to be a page of the report per section. So at the top of each section, you have the, the traffic light area, and these are related to the five questions that you've answered. Then over on the left-hand side, these are really like kind of what you should do now. And these are very tactical, action-orientated points that you can really kind of pick up and act on immediately. To the right of those, then, there's a list of the various Fault Ireland training and support programs that are available, relevant to the particular topic that you're on. So these can be accessed, you can register these through the trade portal and you can also see what's scheduled in your area on the trade portal. Um, the, again, that can be accessed through the Fault Ireland website. At the bottom here, we have a list of the online resources. We have quite an extensive online knowledge hub and there's lots of templates and checklists and videos from the markets, etc. in there. So this section will direct you to all of that information. So once you have your report, if you would like some additional supports from Falter Ireland, you can either contact your local Falter Ireland person, you can call us at this number, or you can contact any of us on the Brexit team at this address, getbrexitready at faltereireland.ie.